Hello, and welcome back to Hearts of Iron for a... As you can see, uh, while I was editing the last Sweden upload, uh, I was playing a cheeky bit of Hoi 4 in the background too. Uh, I can't actually remember what I was doing here. I think I was going for the achievement where you get to the end of the game with France without capitulating before I realised... I already had it. As you can see, it was a absolutely riveting game where uh, I didn't actually do anything just as the achievement asked for. Uh, although again, I already had the achievement, so it was pointless anyway. But yes, welcome back to Housewine 4 A to Z where we are on the letter S, a letter that I have a very hard time pronouncing because as doctors and dentists have told me, my tongue's too big for my mouth. As for I, we're going to be playing Switzerland. But before that, a quick word from our sponsor, Surfshark VPN. Today's sponsor, Surfshark VPN. That's right, keeping yourself secure online has never been more important than it is today. Surfshark VPN comes with a variety of different features to keep you protected online, like their clean web tool, which will search any websites you go on for malicious content that may harm you. Pretty nice. And of course, it is a VPN service, so with the click of a button, you can access any region lock content, despite wherever you may be in the world. And with over 3,000 servers in 65 different countries, you can say goodbye to region lock content for good but the most important feature for me is that you can use surfshark vpn with one login on all of your devices that's right unlimited devices with one login and if you go sign up with surfshark vpn down below by using my code you get yourself 83 percent off and free extra months for free today by just signing up and guess what if you're not happy with the service for whatever reason you can get yourself a 30 day money back guarantee with surfshark VPN. They really help support the channel and I know a lot of you guys have started using them, so feel free, use my link down below, sign up today with Surfshark VPN and get yourself protected online. <sighs> Wow, look at this nation in between all these other great powers in a global conflict. Surely they got involved, right? Uh, they did not. Unless you were smuggling stolen art and gold across the border, then they very much got involved. Hello everybody, welcome to the Zurich Express, where we go to Zurich, disappear into the Aether, and then magically reappear from the mountain. I'm sure you're all very interested to see what I have planned for today. What type of wacky ordeal or mud do I have in store for Switzerland? Hello, dear viewers, and welcome to my democratic, historical Switzerland gameplay video. Today in the news, monkeypox. You guys excited for monkeypox? Uh, I guess I'll go Navy, Switzerland. Uh, I mean... Yeah, sure, why not? Ah, uh, yes, the great resources of Switzerland. Damn! It's a building! They seriously thought I wouldn't do it. I'm committed to an insane asylum. Oh, interventionism or neutrality? Hmm, it's gonna be a hard choice, but I think we'll go with neutrality today. People often ask me if I have a plan when I go into these games, and all I have to say is yes, I do. My plan is to play democratic, neutral, Federal Council's land. Sorry, Switzer Council. That's the one. What's the, uh, what's the deal with Avatar, man? Like, uh... Why are they all blue? Ah, uh, yes. Field Marshal Henry Busset Gussin. Uh, he's a, he's a Winter X bus Gus. Yeah, you know, I think this German guy, he might be up to no good. Should I prepare my armed forces or should I potentially still focus on the Zurich to Bern Railway? Yeah, all right. We'll get to it, okay? You know? We're gonna be sitting here a long time doing nothing because we're neutral. Now, who would invade us, you know? So we should probably get the best defensive doctrine available, which I guess would be Grand Battle Plan for all of the uh, entrenched... 
I slipped! Oh, Italy announced claims on Yugoslavia. I sure hope they don't do that to me because I'd have to beat them up. Just kidding. There is no fun to be found in the Italian focus tree. Who would have thought that my aluminiums would not come in too handy for my economics? You know what? Just to be, uh, just be sure here. I want to be extra sure that we are sure that we absolutely know for sure who's in control. And that's got to be the stupid little hand over here, so I'm gonna get Charles Von Tavel to start shooting everyone that doesn't believe in the house. Yeah, because in the nation I'm playing, I feel like this is a little bit high. But at the same time, maybe my war support is just supporting the war in general and making money off of it. Yeah, things are actually going really great over here in Switzerland. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna go tell my friend Austria all about it. Where'd Austria go? Uh, I could be wrong, but Czechoslovakia also looks like it's slowly disappearing there. Or maybe they uh, started some sort of Hoi 4 challenge where you play every single starting nation and uh, some sort of deep recessed evolutionary uh, brain rot kicked in and now they're slowly withering away. Maybe. Hey, you can see, just researching normal stuff that Switzerland would, really, you know, a bit of construction, some artillery, you know, I doubt we'll ever use it, engineers for getting those trains ready and, uh... Uh, just in case the tractors break down. Oh, there you go. The brain has rotted away. All right, just a few more nations left and I'll be there with you. Oh, this was a major surprise to me after watching all of my neighbors get slowly eaten that a global conflict has erupted in Europe. You see, I really feel like this focus should be renamed for Switzerland from why we fight to why we don't fight. I'm just doing it because there's not a lot else for me to do right now. Well, World War II is going... The same as it really ever does in Hoi 4. I wonder what magical things are happening over here on the African front. Let's have a little cheeky look, shall we? Oh my god, look at that. It's, it's so magical. All of the supply issues, the attrition, the death stack of tanks. It, it, it's beautiful. Oh my god, just in pure seconds like that, the... The, the beauty of it has just come full circle. Anyway, back to boring old Switzerland. Just, uh, you know, producing stuff for my defense force. Don't look at that. Just a very special tractor. Oh, there goes Barbarossa. Uh, sure, the Germans are going to have fun over there, but uh, that's not my problem. I'm neutral Switzerland, just enjoying... Uh... What did they hold referendum? What? Oh, my God. No! How did this clearly non-fabricated event take place? The building! Fritz has bombed the building! It's abhorrent. It's absolutely disgusting that this has been... Don't worry that I'm going to war economy and open the... Cause... Abhorrent! I right, don't worry about the fact I just deployed 45 bees on the Italian border, okay? They're actually just one dude standing with a hundred carabiner K-31s. Uh... Us neutral boys gotta stick together, right? <laughs> All right, where we at? And how slow are we moving? Pretty damn slow. The grand heavy tanks of Switzerland defending Russia in their neutrality. Uh, it's gonna get a little bit complicated with these volunteers, though, as um, reinforcements block no supply from capital. Uh oh. You know what? I didn't like your neutrality revolutionization anyway. I'm out of here. I'm gonna have to go back to the drawing board. Hmm. This is stupid. I, I don't think this will even work. But I like the spirit we've got here. All right, Mr. United Kingdoms. I would love to help you in your quest to bring back neutrality to Europe. No, Switzerland's being overtaken by a swarm of bees. Oh, just arrived on the front lines and he's shiting himself. Oh my God. Why, why have we spawned here? Well, uh, let's quickly skedaddle out of that scenario. All right, so if I actually link up the border here with these units, would well, that mean I will actually have supply from capital that's the question get them the, they are reinforcing everywhere here they know they can't lift the swiss menace in and that just absolutely obliterated those units there so this is a good division a very very expensive division 
but I'll take it. It's pretty cool, though. It just absolutely blows through any infantry in the way of it. No supply from Cafe. Okay, maybe if I send my volunteers to France instead, this would work now. Uh, but for now, I guess we'll just expend them and blow everything up in the way. Oh my god, I'll just look, look at them turn up to a battle and boom! <laughs> why, why can't I just <laughs> go home? <laughs> Hello, members of the Axis. I have come to annihilate everything. Just because we choose not to fight doesn't mean we're not very good at it. I deleted the volunteers and I'm going to retrain them and then when France comes back I'm going to send them to them and hopefully it'll work. Just, uh, hopefully the war's still going by the time they're actually built, eh? Alright, now we have some actual supply from the capital. Uh, this should go a lot better. Uh, you gotta remember, I'm not, not I'm not a war. So this whole neutrality thing is still on the table. It's just a nice neutral vacation into southern France. And if it just so happens to be that with one of the six self-propelled artillery pieces in my mountaineer vacationing boys accidentally runs over a Frenchman on the opposite side. It's just an accident. It just ain't my problem. I do love these divisions though. I just right click on anything and boom, it's evaporated into absolutely nothing in seconds. Is this cost effective though? No, no it is not at all. all right, we've cleaned up the French border enough now. Let's go ahead and have a little fun with the Germans, shall we? Uh, not a lot of Germans really left manning the front lines over here, but uh, I guess they are stretched a wee bit thin right now. Uh, I'm very easily just scooping up the remaining German resistance over here and making the, uh, the spearhead into Germany a lot easier for the Allies, although they're not really... Um, taking the initiative here. Switzerland truly leading the way here. I'm doing this in the true name of neutrality. I have nothing to gain. I have no land or anything, but um, if you do want to make any um, deposits into the Swiss bank, we are always open for business. Oh, I actually we're not open for business. We killed the banks. A lot of people think Carl's okay, but personally, Carl's bad. Oh, you really gotta hand it to British Malaya there, sending a artillery division with no artillery in it. Uh, that may complicate things just a little bit. Oh, that's where I thought the French commune always belongs. In the greater East Asian co-prosperity sphere. Uh, it's not really my problem though. Uh, you know, I'm more of a Switzerland guy. That seems like far away from Switzerland. I think I'll just stay neutral on the whole issue. <laughs> That's right. Just remember, it was the Swiss that walked into Berlin first. Not like it says they're the British. It was the Swiss. If we've ever learned anything from this video, okay? It's never send volunteers to the Soviets as they'll only ruin your life. Whereas if you send them to the Allies, you'll ruin someone else's life. Uh, that's my favorite thing right here. Every time uh, the, the war ends, the Allies just do this to Africa, and it's very confusing. I know they're uh, currently reworking the old uh, peace deals, uh, so I'm hoping we don't see this next time. <laughs> well, next time, whenever the new patch comes out. It would be hilarious, though, if uh, after World War II, Church would just turn around and was like, I'm sorry, France, you were of no use to me, thus I will take half of your country from you. But hey, look at that, we stayed neutral the entire game, other than blowing up the building we were doing politics in and replaced it with a man who we do politics inside of. <laughs> and uh, I guess it never went better with our ridiculously expensive, very Stupid. <laughs> I want to emphasize the stupid <laughs> division we made. Uh, I guess it worked in the end, but it is still absolutely ridiculous. You know, although we also covered Switzerland in a bunch of bees. Uh, hey, if you enjoyed the video, feel free to leave a like and subscribe button down below. There is plenty more Hoi 4 A to Z to go. Not a lot though, but there is plenty more. Just a nice handful of pain, misery, and starting nations in Heart of Iron 4. Uh, and uh, yeah, of course, thank you to everyone supporting the uh, the last video. It went down really well with Bo. And uh, yeah, I appreciate all the likes and subscribes. Still trying to hit 700k, so if you want to Hit the sub button, like I said. Please. Give my life meaning. <laughs> but yes, anyway. Braun, hit the music. It's over. Time to go to bed, Timmy.